everyone, and welcome back to another episode of On The Rocks Gaming Show. Uh, we're still getting over it, but after I fell to where the coffee was, because the coffee gave up, uh, Alex is taking over now, so he's gonna see if he can get over it. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the experience I got from earlier today. Whoa! And get over it. <laughs> you made the same whoop as he did. <laughs> well, it's very fitting. What can I say? Are you... Am I gonna come in to record with you and you're just gonna be in a cauldron? Yeah, well, I'm... I am right now. <laughs> is it gonna be filled with sweat? Because I ain't dealing with it. Oh, oh yes it is. No. You know how much I sweat. <laughs> of course it is. Oh. What? Oh, Okay. <laughs> Whatever works for no, you, on, Bennett. on the light. Yeah. I'm, tr I'm trying to keep it on the light. And then, Whoops. Ooh, you gotta go... That's alright. Count... Yeah, counterclockwise. I will counter the clock if I have to. <laughs> Can you smell? With the clock. <laughs> <laughs> I, it's just such a fitting noise for going up. Whoop! You've done this part before. You know it's possible. I haven't Do done this fart, fart before. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? I'm in. Uh, <gasps> you did it. Slow. Yep. It's so weird to get a handle on, like, where your hammer is in relation to your center of gravity. Whoops. That's okay. Whoa. Uh, okay. Boyo. That's uh, alright. Any mistake I make, it's my fault, not the game's. You gotta not get mad. Which is funny, because I get mad all the time. I don't think getting mad really, uh... I mean, I wasn't getting mad. Yeah, you In the beginning right. I was, but then afterwards it was just panic. I guess it's because of the whole... What, what I'm doing here is pulling a contrast to all the other YouTubers that play this. They always get so angry. I mean, it is pretty infuriating sometimes. It can be frustrating, yeah. But it's just hard. It's not actually like... I don't know. You I don't did feel... It. I did! Yay! I don't feel it's as infuriating as people always made it seem, which is why I want to play it. Ooh. Because it just seems so... So close. It but, seemed kind of fun. I don't know. But no it waffle. Is. It is kind no, of you fun. Can't, you can't stop. It's alright. I'm learning. I'm learning to get over it. And taking your time and going slow is important. No matter what the problem is, thinking will get you through a lot of it. Such good noises on behalf of this dude. They really express how it feels to Pull yourself up a mountain of bricks in a cauldron with a hammer. Yeah, I, th I think this is exactly what it sounds like. I've done it before. Well, then how come you're not over it already? The vertical wall okay, now that's infuriating. <laughs> I think anger makes you swing the hammer harder, and that can push you away from the wall. Yes, it can. Thank you for the advice, Bennett. Although I wasn't using harder swinging hammer as anger output. I was using it as a momentum thing. It's a, it's more so about timing on the wall, because you can uh, only grasp uh, the edges. Yeah. So when you have the timing of only grasping the edges, it helps. Oops. Because <laughs> as soon as you touch wall, it pushes you away. That was a funny little hop. No. Is that Bennett or me? I think it was Bennett. That was too slow there. Mm. Too fast there. Oh no, that's him. It, it, oh. My little guy's making angry sounds, I think. Maybe to try and. Yeah, to try and. Oh, he's grunting. Imitate my anger. He's going. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I relate with this man because when he is angry, he goes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! That's it. That's all there is to it. Ah, that was nice. That was a nice little trip. You got a shimmy. That was an accidental click. Now, I have not done this part before. 
So you gotta do that, yeah. Okay. Don't go too much to the right. See, the first comparison I heard of this game was to Quop. But this actually <laughs> has functioning mechanics. Oh my god, Quop is so terrible. Although I did beat Quop as well. I didn't. I just I tried to see how far you could get negatively. <laughs> did you did you do well? I, at least. Yeah. I think I I think I ran into something, but I don't remember if I did or not. Because I think if you do it backwards, it still puts you into hurdles. Or you can just go forever. You can probably just go forever, my guess. Hey, you made it to where I made it. I did. And honestly, ah. it wasn't so bad. I think I'm getting over it pretty alright. You want to be really close to the umbrella before you pull yourself over it. Yeah. Because all the curved ledges are like, nah, we don't want to pull you up, we just want to push you away. It's okay though. That's another part of life. No. Getting pushed away by umbrellas? Yeah. <laughs> no, I meant don't push yourself that direction like that. What do you mean? Oh, there's a slide! How did they... Oh, that's a lot of boxes. <laughs> Also, there's, yeah, it is. how did they balance that slide on this play thing? So look at look it up there. Yeah, I can see it. What, I don't are, you, know. what are you doing, people? You're like physics masters. There's a kid up here. That that kind of worries me. <laughs> kid, how did you get up here, and where are your parents? <laughs> yeah, that, I, that's that's kind of the most important question here. Where are your parents, child? I don't know if I was supposed to go this way. You did it. You got farther than me. Uh, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Maybe go that way? Oh, yeah, maybe, because that's on top of the... The no. pain I feel now is the happiness I had before. Like, in between those that's boxes, maybe? Or should I keep trying to go up the when slide? You go, no, I'm saying when you go to the right, you remember on top of this roof, uh, to the right, there's the stuff I was jumping up to, but I couldn't reach it. Yes. You might yes. have to go that way. Perhaps. You may be right. I may oh, be that crazy. Was close. But it just might be a lunatic you're looking for. What are you even. Who got I'm that lawnmower up here? Who got all this everything up here? Who found all those boxes that are like office boxes with those skids that are clearly not from office spaces? <laughs> Skid master over here. And who, who packed those skids? That was a they're definitely Peace. not packed the way they're supposed to be. A still and quiet conscience. William Shakespeare. William Shakespeare. Take note, I did only play this for about 15, 20 minutes or something. I'm going to see if I can get it. I didn't play this at all before I played. No, I... I, I, I meant um, today. Oh. Am I stuck? No. Okay, I was for a little bit there. I was, I was pushing against those boxes, but it wasn't working. You want to hang off of that box, maybe. You might be right. <laughs> and you can you can momentum yourself towards the. I don't want to go too fast. You cannot now believe that you will ever feel better. But this is not true. <laughs> no. You're sure to be okay. happy again. And knowing this, I'm not actually frustrated again, right now. I, I really don't feel that bad at all. Abraham Lincoln. No sarcasm either. I think uh Aww. Whoa. That's that, a little that frustrating. Was fast. Um I think when you're given something that's supposed to induce anger, you're immediately prepared for to the be angry. for the okay. This is a game that makes you angry. Therefore, I may or may not be angry. So you have a lot more prep to not be angry. Yeah, probably that that makes sense. So if like with Quop, when someone first hands it to you, you're just kind of like, "What is this?" And then you have to figure out how to play, and then you realize you can't play. Um, <laughs> but, and then the same with this, someone just hands this to you and you're like, okay, well, what do I do? 
Oh, so close. Except, yeah, this is a lot better than Quad. Oh yeah. A million times. You, what was it? I, I remember finding hurdles for the first time, and I was like, <laughs> what do you mean there's hurdles? I can't remember if hurdles start at like 50 meters, or... Um, it's been a long time since you, I played Quad. You, what do you, you like do the one leg knee bent and then the other on the ground, so you're basically like knee shimmying oh, no. all the way to wherever you have to, and then there's jumping, Oops. and you're just... Oh no. Whoa. I'm getting re reckless. That looks like Spanish. Maybe. I'm trying to get momentum. <laughs> I don't know why, I feel like... I'm probably gonna be wrong, but I feel like that says caution wet cement. <laughs> Maybe. Oops. Oof. This is pretty stressful right now. Because this is where you can fall all the way down. As we saw on a previous episode of Amarok's Game Show. Oh no, I fell. No, I think That's I okay, I'm on the boat now. I think I spelled it wrong. A little bit of frustration, Whoa. but not that bad. Mm. Did you do the same thing I did? Yeah, well, uh, I fell in the same spot. Oh. Although, I see where, you know, when you fall down there, why you would want to go very fast here now. A, because you just lost a bunch of progress. But B, more importantly, you feel like you've beaten this part before, so now you got to go fast at it. You know what I mean? I think it's, it's, well, for me... Like, it's, like your, your unofficial speedrunner. Well, for me, it's more like I have the the grasp of how the game wants me to work in this area because I've done it, but then in the new areas, it's like, okay, well, what do you want from me in this area? Yeah. How am I supposed to feel about this hammer being in these positions and putting me elsewhere? Also, I must say, it feels very gratifying when the physics work, like when they oh, work yeah. exactly how you want them to. Beautiful. It feels good. It's as nice as that ivy they put on there. Does it move? Oh, nice ivy. It does, it sways. Oh, that's yeah. so nice. This music is nice too. It is, I enjoy this. Okay, I, I kind of get how to get up there now. Yeah, Whoops. see, there's a part of you that gets used to like how it wants you to maneuver. Yeah. But then in the new areas, you're like, okay, well, hold on, what does it want from me now? Whoa. Oh no. Wait, Sorry. launch yourself. I can't from this angle. You jiggle yourself. <laughs> yeah. Easier said than done. Yeah. I don't think I should have jiggled myself. Do it. Launch. Whoop. There we go. Got it. No problem. See? The start isn't even frustrating anymore. <laughs> That's something you learn too. The beginning seems hard, but once you've done it a few times, it's fine. Yeah. Now just the new stuff is hard. Speaking of which, speaking of new stuff, we're going to stop in a new place, because we haven't stopped here before. Segways, yay! Thank you for joining <laughs> us on this episode of On The Rocks Gaming Show. Join us next time when we continue to get over it. Because, really, as long as you're calm, as long as you take your time, getting over it is not that hard. See you guys!